Okay guys, to start your work, click File and New button. After clicking, a new screen will appear and it will look like this. And this screen will let you customize your sizes. So I choose to put 16 pixels for the width and for the height, I'll be putting 8. And click create. Your worksheet will look like this. And your next move will be putting a background for your thumbnail. So for you to do that, click file and click the open button. I have here downloaded pictures that I want to use for my thumbnail. And I'm going to use this one for my background. I already opened a new tab. And I have to double click this one to unlock it. And click OK. Next is click the arrow button and drag this picture into the first tab, which is your worksheet. Unlock the white background by double clicking and delete. And we're going to adjust now our chosen background in your keyboard. Press Ctrl T to adjust the size. Hold shift and click the corner and drag. After putting your background, click file and click open button. So we're going to put cinematic bars. Click the arrow tool and drag the cinematic bars into your background. To adjust this layer, do the same process as earlier. Press Ctrl T and hold Shift to adjust your size of this cinematic bars. After adjusting, it will look like this. After placing our cinematic bars, we're going to design now our thumbnail. After placing your design, next step is placing your captions in your thumbnail so you have to click the text tool and click on your worksheet and start typing your captions just like this you can also adjust your fonts and change the sizes of your text and you can place it anywhere that you want to place it in your thumbnail.
putting your captions in your thumbnail, your last step will be your finishing touches. Make sure that everything is in place and finalize all of your adjustments. The output looks like 